Oh, well, it is 3.30 the next day. We are sitting in Bentonville, Arkansas. Uh, we pulled in. We're just waiting on the guy to come meet us. I wonder if I should just follow this Maxim guy. No, he said call him. Yeah, anyway, he's supposed to be meeting us. Today is Thursday and we don't have another load. So when I was looking for our loads in Arkansas, I was like, man, Arkansas looks really good. Bentonville is in the northwestern corner, basically right next to Oklahoma. Um, that's basically Oklahoma. So we're having a rough time finding a load that's gonna work. Kind of like when we found this load. I was thinking, uh, I guess I should have looked it up. Honestly, I just kind of pounced on it. I mean, it, it, this load paid really good. We got here in less than a day, or yeah, less than 24 hours. But we just have to find something, trying to find something where we can hopefully deadhead today, be ready to pick up Friday, and drive like fr Friday, Saturday-ish, you know? But it's not looking good. There is some, the market has slowed down a lot. Everywhere. My brother was just up by Akron and they we looked on the board for him all day long. We finally found him something going to South Carolina. But my goodness, that area used to be hot. And now it is not. You know, when we were in Ohio, like um, wherever that was called that we just left, Chillicothe, Chillicothe, is that, is that the name of it? Yeah. I mean, that, we took this load here because everything else was kind of rough. Anyways, Lita's called this guy, he's texted this guy, she's texted this guy, not getting a response, not sure what's going on. Supposedly they quit at four o'clock, it's 3.30 right now, so. Guess they'll be working late since they don't want to answer the phone. Oh! Alright, I don't know. I guess I'll get back to you guys, let you guys know what's going on. Three new loads popped on. Texas, Texas, nope. Nashville, Tennessee. We could go to Nashville, Tennessee, baby. It's not paying good enough. Only 269 a mile. No, thank you. I would dang sure go back to Nashville, Tennessee, though. That place was fun. All right, see you guys in a bit. Well, we're unloaded and we almost messed that load up. So that big metal, black metal cage looking thing, you're not supposed to put chains on those. I'm like, that's weird. There was uh, there was two guys watching me strap it and chain it down. They never said anything. So yeah, they're like, if a chain rubs a mark through it, the half more, what they say, half of the thickness of that, of those tubes, they gotta cut those tubes out and replace the tubes. So, In one quarter mile, they almost didn't let us unload it. I think they were gonna send us back. Which, I mean, I would've been all right with that. I would've sucked for them, but you can pay me to send it back. I don't have another load yet. So, uh, but.
but I think they ultimately looked, ultimately looked at it and decided that it wasn't that bad. So I don't know. I, they didn't say anything when we picked it up. So. Turn left at the traffic light. I guess if you ever pick up one of those things and you know it's for a crane, don't use chains on it, only straps. So that's good to know. They're like, don't sweat it, man. You, nobody told you it's not that big of a deal, but I'm like, man, it's it's still an embarrassing thing to me that I could have possibly screwed something up, even if it wasn't my fault. So I got a little truck stop punched in right now. We're gonna go grab a shower. Hopefully Mason finds something and we can get our deadhead done today. Um, but probably not. I don't see this gas dude. This, this truck's up on here. Really? Yeah, really. Wow, would this light get like two cars through it? Fantastic. Alright, we'll see you guys later. Alright. So we have moved down to Springdale, Arkansas. Uh, we still don't have a load. So, yeah, let's walk over this way. Uh, we're at a pilot. Parking was $24. $23, shower was $14. So that's pretty much a hotel room right there. Let's keep walking, guys. There's a bunch of trash back here. So, Mason's called on probably a million loads today. Most of them are ridiculous. We might have one. We might. But uh, none of the brokers were there to sign rate cons or anything, so they told us to call back in the morning. Uh, um, yeah, I don't know. I mean, there's some, uh, there's some garbage loads on the board. I don't know if it's because we're so close to Oklahoma. I just checked Arkansas like before we came here and I'm like, wow, Arkansas is doing amazing. But we're basically in Oklahoma. Arkansas is a bigger state than I thought. It's like 400, what did Mason say, like 435 yeah, wide? So I figured if I open up my deadhead like 200 miles, it would hit pretty much the whole state. And I was absolutely wrong. Anyways, we've uh, ordered some uh, Mediterranean food huh mm -hmm. uh we should yeah what was it 60 bucks with tip my huh $50. no it was 60 dollars with tip okay. wasn't it yeah i'm pretty sure it was 60 bucks with tip uh view receipt 6320 6320 uh delivery fees 99 service fee we should probably just have uh paid for doordash monthly fee anyways this is where we're at we just got a shower got us some food ordered um it's been rough this has been a rough week huh yeah i don't know all right well we're going to uh walk the dogs maybe if the food looks amazing i'll show you guys you guys know i'll probably show you that last, where was that place at we got that Mediterranean food? Napdown. Oh my gosh. In I've been Greenville. dreaming about it ever since. In Greenville? Yeah. Oh, you know where it is. Yeah. Fantastic. All right. We'll see you guys in a bit. I'm surprised the skateboarders aren't down in here. Hey, let's look in these tunnels first, fat butts. Let's go check this out first. Look at this. You got this big tunnel right here. What is that, Mackie? Hey. Quit getting tangled up. Watch this, fat butts. Watch this. Nula! Echo! Echo! Hello! I bet this tunnel will work better over here. Nula! Hello! Who is that in there, Nula? Mackie! Hello! Mackie! Are you scared of that? It's okay, Val. Come on, jump up in there. 
No? She's scared. Yeah, she's not like that. Yeah, dude, this would have been a paradise for her. Come on. Skaters. Slow down. Just because you got a 20 foot lead doesn't mean you have to use it all. I do. I gotta get the fuck out of here. I'm going to die down here. I mean, it's so hot. Look at this. I'm wearing my, my shower shoes. I'm just, it is ridiculously hot, man. I mean, could you imagine getting on a skateboard and like going in the tunnel, figuring out the other end of that, just flying through? That'd be awesome. That would be awesome. It's like a All right, DoorDash just dropped off her food. Let me see, where was this from? Kisiki Mediterranean Grill. Right yeah, Tzatziki Mediterranean Cafe. Oh, does it? Alright, let's break out that food. She didn't give me the same thing she got me last time. She didn't have it. So, That's a make your own stuff. I'm gonna be upset if this isn't as good. Cause... Cause what? Because I pointed out the Mediterranean restaurant. And if it comes back to bite me in the butt. Me and you fixing to have problems. Yeah, you think so? Alright. Let's check it out. 60 something dollars? Yeah. $63? That's your silverware. Let's go back to this. Some fall asleep on me. Alright, so what do, how do I what do I do with this? So that's just a regular salad, right? Yeah, it's, like, a, it's a Greek salad. And then this is no, no, I have to open it up. Those are your potatoes. potatoes. Bread potatoes. And then your meat's in there. And then what do I do with my meat? Put it in my salad? I mean you can put it in the salad or you can put it on this like pita thing. Just two uh, very small pieces of steak. That's nice. Two very small pieces of steak. So I basically just bought a. Oh, there's three pieces of steak here. It kind of looks like fake steak. How it's got the grill marks on there. Oh yeah. Kind of like they do like the dog treats. Mm, that's a bummer. Yeah, you can have Mmm. So basically, it's a steak salad. Um, I thought you were supposed to have pita in there. Did they short us? Because we need to let DoorDash know if they did. Yeah. It'll be right here. Let's see, um, account. Orders. Is this a pita? I mean, those are pita chips. Maybe that's what they're talking about. Mm. A big pita. Is that a big pita? Yeah. Well, I don't know what's Mediterranean about this. Definitely doesn't look like the picture. Or do you like the sauce? I don't know, what is it? It's just deep in sauce. Just stick your finger in it. Like I got extra. I got some here no, too. No, that's Greek dressing. It's alright. 
What's the difference? There is a street dressing. I don't know what's in green dressing. It's just EP sauce comes with a gyro. I got a gyro, but I asked for any. So what's this? This is a bummer. Mm. And that's your salad dressing. What kind of salad dressing? Greek. It's not bad. Yeah. It's not, I mean, it's not ranch, but I like it. Let me see what that other container is. Right. Those are hot. Oh, there's food in here. I mean, the steak's cooked pretty damn good. No dressing. This has got feta in it. Oh. Give us two cases of steak. Man. I was really hoping I got what I had last time, because that was good. Damn, dude, it's... That's, that was a completely different restaurant, though. I'm gonna make your own bowl restaurant. So I got to pick whatever I could put on in that bowl. This they had like made up made up menu items, so it wouldn't ever be the same. Like they overcooked the chips. Yeah. You want to try by my gyro? Sure. It's lamb. Is that lamb in there? In there? Yeah, look at all that. Yeah. In there. Yeah, it fell out. Now, this looks dope right here. disappointment off the video. <laughs> See you guys later.